Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So you're gonna have to really excuse my appearance this morning. I literally just woke up like 20 minutes ago and saw that this, this package was on my front door. Haven't even had my coffee, none of that. So I had to quickly like set up my room and like throw on my can't relate t-shirt for this occasion. Um, because I finally got my Jeffree Star mystery box for Valentine's Day. And I also ordered one of the um, fuzzy Sherba jackets, so I'm super excited. Um, so the only thing I did was cut open the box. So we're going to dig in this together. Now, I haven't watched any spoilers for the, oh, I love the tissue paper, for the um, deluxe box on purpose. I've only watched spoilers or unboxings of the premium and the Cream, I think it's called so like the smallest one and the, the biggest one I'm kicking myself because I would have totally been okay with like the $60 one for once but that's the gamble with these mystery boxes is you know the one time uh, nothing I don't think anything thus far has beaten the Halloween box when I got the shirt I got the at that time it was a $75 box but it was the middle one I usually try to go for the smallest or the middle and that one was like the best by far so until I see what's in this but I heard like one possible spoiler for this one and I know I'm going to be disappointed because it's a repeat so I'm hoping that I at least get half of my money back for this box but that's just the gamble that you take with the mystery boxes because they're a mystery but I always seem to pick the one like the next time that's like the most disappointing and like the smaller one sometimes the best sometimes it's the biggest one sometimes like I don't know but it is what it is this time I got it I didn't get one for Christmas because of that whole like <clears throat> oh you got it it's whatever but I really never did get it so I wanted to make sure I got it this time with this release um and treat myself a little bit so the first thing is the Sherpa jacket <clears throat> now the one video I did watch the girl got one of these and she got the $60 box and she was like a plus size girl but she said that they ran oh my gosh a little small so I'm a little concerned yeah, it looks a little small, but it says Jeffree Star approved on the back, super soft, and it has the Jeffree Star logo, and it's a full zip, so that's kind of nice. Oh, and it's the Sherpa lining, like, inside and out. But, oh my gosh. Oh, I'm going to zip it. Oh, that's not awful, actually. I think what makes it seem like it's small is like excuse my pajama pants is that it has like the elastic on the bottom but it looks it doesn't look too bad and i mean i'm only sitting down but it's definitely warm and comfortable like super soft super plush so i'm not going to keep it on though because it's hot in this room and i don't want to like if i swatch anything i don't want to get it dirty so okay i'll see what that looks like when i stand up though but i love that oh okay now It's heavy. It's heavy. Let's see. But um, just shout out to love this card, keeping this, decorating this with my vanity from the Shane Dawson launch. Um, I have my conspiracy palette. Obsessed. Love. I mean, this is all I wore over the holidays. There was some love in that palette. I was going to do a look with it on a video on my channel, but honestly, at this point. There's no point. So this little card came in it. So that's going to go on my vanity. All right. Let's get into the box. Feels heavy-ish. So I don't know how much it weighs because it came in a bigger box with the Sherpa. So we shall see. It's probably a good three or four pounds, honestly. All right. So I'm going to do this the same way that I did my other mystery box. I'm going to put the box to the side and just kind of reach in and grab stuff so I don't see any spoilers. Okay. So the first thing, okay. So this little baseball cap. Hmm. All right. So it's a little pink baseball cap with the Jeffree Star logo on the back, or the front, and then it has the logo on that. I mean, I'm not going to wear it because it's pink, <laughs> but 
but my best friend will definitely get use out of this, so that will go to her. Okay, a little disappointing, but that's okay. Tissue paper. Uh, ooh, ooh, okay. So when you got, this was the only box that they had this go around that had a size. Ah! So this is the shirt. It has the cute little sweetheart on the front. And then it has the same design that the hoodie has on the back. So I'm super excited for that. I mean, this is like the only saying that I'm kind of like, eh, you know, to wear it out. But I'm not mad. This is cute. And I wanted the hoodie too, honestly. But... I'm kind of happy that it came with a t-shirt because I don't need any more hoodies. So, okay. All right. It's not terrible. Oh. See, some kind of palette. What? He put in a skin frost 24 karat gold palette. I know that the biggest box got the brain freeze. Oh my God. <gasps> Look at that packaging. Oh my God, that's beautiful. <gasps> wow. Okay, now, honestly, I think only one of these shades I might be able to wear, like this one, sarcophagus, because I'm so pale. <laughs> but I could definitely use these on my eyes. Like this could be a really pretty blush topper, honestly. Like that is gorgeous oh yes definitely a blush topper oh my gosh that's beautiful wow and i know that these palettes run like close to 50 dollars, maybe i don't know but okay i'm not mad about that that's gorgeous that, that's definitely nice to have in my collection especially for when i do other people's makeup and their skin tone is like darker than mine okay the thing i'm feeling right now is i think something yeah i already know what this is this is the repeat, and that's so disappointing. This is the mini breaker palette that I got in the Halloween box. So I already have that in my collection. So I don't need this. <laughs> that's gonna go to my best friend. So she's gonna get two of my items, <laughs> that's okay. And then, let's see. Ooh, okay, this is one of the exclusive items. This is one of the liquid lips. <clears throat> So let's see, I love the red packaging. But it's in the shade Mystery, has a little heart. Oh, that is really pretty. It's like a metallic, like pink. Oh, it smells just like his lipstick, okay. Wow. It's, I'm not gonna lie, it is a little streaky, but it, metallics are always kind of you got to kind of build them up a little bit, but that's actually super pretty. That's really similar to this, um, this Ofra lipstick I got in a boxy charm. It's like a pink metallic. This one's a little bit lighter, but I do really like the way this looks on my lips, even though I'm not a big pink, um, lipstick fan, but I'm going to try this on. I'm going to use my Shane mirror that I just got. I love it. Oh, oh, wow. Yeah, it's really patchy. I'm not gonna lie. Like when I just like, with my lips, it just kind of went away. So that's actually really disappointing for Jeffrey. But I don't hate that. That's actually really pretty. And it's kind of nice that it is a little bit more sheer and like patchy because then it's not like wham in your face metallic pink. But like, I don't hate that. Okay, all right. I'm okay with that. It's not bad. I know my one, my friend was worried, that she watched videos and she was worried that I might not like the lipstick shade, but it's growing on me. I like it. Okay, I know what this next thing is because I can feel the box. Ooh, okay. So this is a gloss and I got, I bought one myself, Legends Only, love it. I got a second one. I got this one in um, sequin glass in my last box and I love it. It's like a purple gray, but it looks gorgeous on the lips by itself. So this one is Candy Drip. This is my best friend's favorite shade. 
so I know that if it's not for me, I can give it to her and she can have it as a backup. But this one is like a really pretty pink. But I think I am going to like it. It's almost like a pinky nude. But I think that's going to look really pretty on top of just my bare lips. So definitely excited to have another gloss in my collection because I really do love his gloss formula. And okay, the next thing in here is a mirror. Oh, God. Okay. I don't need another mirror. Good Lord. All right. Let's see. I'm anxious to see what, like, design this one is, though. I don't think it's one of the, um, if I could find my scissors. Oh, all right, we'll just use tweezers. I don't, tweezers, I don't think it's going to be one of the, um, exclusive, like, Valentine's Day ones. But, so I got, I bought one of his blue ones. I got the orange exclusive one in the Halloween box. And then I bought the Shane one off Beautylish. Oh. This one is a gold chrome. Hmm. Okay. That's pretty. I don't need it. I'm probably just going to give it to either my friend or my sister. She might like this. But that is really pretty. Ooh. Okay. I have the blue chrome one and I really like it. But I have to say that I think my favorite mirror design is definitely the Shane Pig because it, it has a lot more surface area. So, okay. I mean, I'm not awfully mad at that. And there was one more. Ooh. Last thing in the box. <gasps> stop it's a black pack of straws i was afraid they were gonna be pink which i don't care they're just straws but oh, i'm so excited there's a matte i gotta open it there's a matte black straw in this kit oh my gosh okay oh i'm totally gonna use this like right away so this is like the matte black and it has his name on it oh my god that is fantastic. And it comes with a cleaner. So there's three curved straws, a straight straw, and a cleaner. But it's the black one. So I'm so excited. I love metal straws. Oh, this is exciting. Okay. Okay. So overall, I, I'm not mad at this box. I thought I was going to be super upset because of the repeat with this freaking mini breaker. But I think, honestly, the rest of it did kind of make up for it. Like, I do really like this lipstick. The more that I have it on, I think it's really pretty. Even if it's just, if I just kind of dab it on. So I'm not mad at it. So the pack of straws, that's what, $20. The lipstick or lip gloss is 18. So is the lipstick. The shirts, they usually run like 25. The palette, totally worth it. So honestly, one, two, three, four, five. Five items out of eight that I'm gonna keep. Like, the mirror is great and all, but I don't need another mirror. Like, I really don't. The hat, if it weren't pink, I would totally keep it and wear it. And I already have this. So, honestly, I'm not, like, five out of eight items for me to keep. I, I'm, 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 I'm okay. I'm okay with that. I definitely made my money on that. And then I have my little Sherpa jacket, so I'm super excited about that. But, yeah, so that was the, um, the deluxe mystery box unboxing for you guys. And... I don't think I'm going to stop getting the mystery boxes. I think I'll, I'll keep trying and maybe next time I'll try for the smallest one, although watch that be like the worst one next time. But that's just the gamble you take with the mystery boxes. So anyway, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. Let me know down below if there's anything else that you would like to see me film. I do want to try to get back into it more. But other than that, I will see you guys next time. And thanks for watching. Bye.